If there are still some myeloma cells left, why isn't that treated like residual disease? That's such a, a, a great question where we're often in a situation where we treat patients and we want to get rid of the disease, but sometimes there's that little bit left. And we may be tempted to say, well, let's just treat more, let's treat more aggressively and get rid of that last little bit. And sometimes we actually may decide to do that. In particular, when patients have high risk disease, that tiny little bit left puts them at high risk of it growing back. But interestingly, there are some patients who have a tiny amount of disease left that will actually just sit there very quietly. Uh, once at a conference, I described that little bit of residual disease left as being either Rambo or Bambi, meaning we need to know, is this aggressive or is this not aggressive? So this has to be discussed with your healthcare team and what the history of the myeloma has been. Because again, we don't want to over-treat nor under-treat our patients. So we can give them the right treatment that's gonna keep their disease down and give them the quality of life that they need.